Hello and welcome back to Nisi's Custom. Today I'm going to show you all the basic how to do things on Silhouette Studio. But before we begin, go ahead and hit that subscribe, subscribe button and that notification bell so you won't miss none of my videos. I know guys, it was a long time that y'all heard from me. I think it was probably three weeks, but I had so much going on. So much going on. So much death around me. My neighbor across the street passed away. My neighbor next door from me passed away. And my oldest son's, my oldest son father passed away all in that small amount of time. Matter of fact, my son father passed away one Sunday morning. Then my neighbor next door to me passed away that same Sunday. They, he died that Sunday night. So I was busy helping my son go through um, all that and, you know, comforting him and telling him, you know, his daddy loved him and everything. And I really wasn't, I'm going to tell you the truth, I really wasn't even focusing on YouTube or doing any orders or anything because I had so much other so some other stuff to get through you know and all of them died from covid so people please wear your mask i mean just wear them that's the only way this pandemic is gonna go away i never thought in a million years that my son father would pass away not in a million years but God do things for a reason. And it was his time to go. And don't never. I thought about my YouTube family. I thought about my, my subscribers. My supporters. And I want to give a big thanks. Thanks to Miss O'Brien. Because she was right there. She called me, asked me how I was doing, if I needed anything. She was right there from the from the from the start. And I appreciate her. She just don't know how much I appreciate her. Okay. So let's go ahead and begin this tutorial um, on Silhouette Studio. But I'm gonna just show the basic how to move image files from one place to another and do some other stuff okay now when i do my when i get my image off the internet off of google um i always get the ping file if you get the ping file that's the when you look up the image i'm gonna show you okay i'm gonna show you when you look up the image Oh, let me see. If my computer stop acting crazy. Okay, let's say um Gamecock logo. Okay. Images. Slowly but surely, it is coming. And another thing, I am not a professional. I'm not saying that I know everything. I'm not saying that I am the guru of Silhouette Studio. But I am learning the same way that you're learning. And I'm just showing the stuff that I learned for myself. Basically, we learning together. Okay? Okay. So, if we go to image. And when you get the ping file, is the ping file is not going to have that white background behind it. Like, say, for instance, this file right here. Okay. 
my computer is so slow. See, you see how that, um, how the, the checkerboard is in the back. When I save this file right here and put it in my pictures and I go back to Silhouette Studios, it's not going to have that background. So I'm going to just show you. But right now, I'm going to show you with the file. The file is, I'm going to start with file. You have new, new project wizard, open, open recent. That's what open recent mean, recent mean. That's something that you was already working on. And you can just pull it up. Open recovery. Open recovery is like, um, say for instance, you shut down the computer real fast or the computer cuts off or the power went out or anything like that. And you didn't save your file. That would it mean. That's what it means, recovery. So you can come over here and get the last file that you did and pull it up and it will pull up. Okay. And merge. Merge is where you go and pull the image that you want on your On your, um, I'm sorry about that. I just lost train of thought a few minutes ago. That you want to um, make a design with. Okay. Say for instance, uh, the cow. Okay. You see that? It's you know it's already on the back on the background. But if you move it over, see when you move it over, it don't have that white background. So that's what I mean by when you want to get an image off Google, get the one, the ping file. Don't get the JPEG. Always get the ping file because it's not going to have that white background behind it. Okay. And again, that's how you um, get your image. You're going to go to merge. Then another screen is going to come up and you just go to your picture. Whatever you got that image, that's where you want to pull it from. Merge and whatever you got in your pictures. Okay. Let me cancel that. Okay, and you have edit. Everything in edit is going to be over here if you hit, if you right click on the image that you're trying to edit. It's all, you don't never have to go up here. Just go here, click your image, right click, and everything is going to pop up. Okay, then view. View is where the zoom, you have zoom right here, and you also have zoom right here as well. Then the ruler, the ruler is right here above this. Um, you have the crosshair the crosshair is you see i don't know if you can see it or not but you can see the crosshair how it's going back and forth yeah that's the cross the crosshairs okay then you have the grid option that's when you want to um if you were using a mat the cutting mat on silhouette if you want to use um the machine that's when you want to that's where that comes in at then the snap grid the show grids it's everything that's basically right here is on the side that's it um this right here is show border print it's showing the border print right here and it's 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 located right here and it's also located 
on this right here too. Basically, what I'm trying to say that view is right here on the page setup. Okay, then you got the panels. You can use the panels right here or you can use the panels right here on the side. Same thing. It's just one is located one place and the other one is located right here. That's it. Then you have the mirror uh, arrangement that if you have multiple um, multiple images on here. I'm going to pull another image and I can show you. Matter of fact, I don't have to pull another image. I can just do it right here. Make that. Change that color. Okay, say for instance, you want to. Okay, you see how the blue box is over the cow's face? Say for instance, you want to move the cow in front of the blue box. The only thing you have to do is right click it and hit bring to front. And that's how you move it. That's it. Just simple, plain and simple. If you're not understanding, following along what I'm trying to say, just leave a comment in the um down in the comment section, and I'll try to answer your question as much as possible. And I will, tr I will try. Like I say, I am not a professional. I'm just learning. I had to teach myself how to do this right here. Never looked at no YouTube videos. I had to learn for myself. And what I learned for myself, I wanted to share with y'all. And some things that I don't know, um, we're going to learn together. That's why I say we're going to learn together. Okay. Like I say, the, you know, what I did it. The mirror image and all that is, and you can also right click and all that will be right here too when you right click on the image. Okay. Well, I'm going to do uh, another video um, Thursday and I'm going to drop that video. But I just wanted to show you just a few basic things on the Silhouette Studio. And this right here, I'm using the business edition. So a business, the business edition have a little bit more stuff than the basic, but I'm showing you what's in the basic that you can learn quicker and show you the easiest stuff. Okay. Well, um, my next video, I'm gonna show you show you the different panels on how to do, do the use the different panels, um, use different fonts, and whatever y'all leave me in the comment section, what you want what you want to learn, and I'll show you. Okay, like I say. I'm sorry it took a long time to make these videos, but I'm back and hopefully everything will be smoothing out soon. But please, guys, use your mask, wear your mask, put hand sanitizer on every time you use um, transaction with money or anything. Please, please, please be safe out there and always remember God loves you. And I love you too. And I'll see you soon. Peace.